Hi, I am Amit Gupta. I welcome you for the training program of Vaichu Channel. I am working as Assistant Manager Training for Yatra Holiday Advisor Channel in Yatra.com. I take care of entire training function of this particular channel. Through this particular training module, we are going to talk about how uh, the industry landscape looks like for the travel market in India. We are going to learn about what are the different sales channels in Yatra.com and how Yatra Holiday Advisor channel in particular is different from the other sales channels. We are also going to learn about how the organizational structure looks like for this particular channel in Yatra.com and later towards the end of this particular module we are going to talk about the difference between two major types of packages sold in Indian market those are the group departures and the fully customized packages. For all your future references we will uh, talk about how the travel industry works and how Yatra as a major player works in this particular travel industry we will talk about what all are the types of packages as in what are the group departures which are sold by Yatra and what kind of customized packages are sold by Yatra we will also see uh, the customer base that we have uh, for packages in India with reference to their income groups with reference to their age groups also we will uh, consider what sort of packages a person buy considering their family composition Let's go further. Through this particular slide, we are going to learn about how the production and supply of the packages works. Like any other retail channel, like any other production chain out there in the market for any given product, same kind of supply chain we have for packages. We start with the principles. Principles are the manufacturers of the service. Since we are not dealing in physical products, we are dealing in the services. We don't call them the manufacturers, we just call them the principals. A principal supplier can be anyone from where the service is originated. As you can see in this particular slide, it can be your airlines, it can be your hotels, it can be the bus operator, it can be the cruise operator, it can be the sightseeing vendor as well. Then we come to the distributors. Distributors can be anyone who buy these particular services, who buy these particular products from the principal vendors and later they supply them forward either to the customers or further to the retailers. Under distributors as well, we have some bifurcations. We start with the consolidator. What consolidators do is they get in touch with every individual principal vendor, they get in a legal contract with them and they buy a product from them. They fix a special rate uh, as a part of their contract and they add some profits and supply them forward either to the customers or to the retailers. Now, they can when they forward these particular products, they can do it in two different ways. One, they can sell the individual product. For example, they sign up with an airline, they get into a legal contract with an airline and they start selling airline alone. Later, they get into a legal contract with some hotel chain and they start selling hotel itself. On the other hand, what they can do is they can make a package, they can make a hamper and offer it to the customer on a lump sum. For example, one particular distributor, say Yatra.com, they get into a legal contract with some airline, they get into a legal contract with some hotel, they get into a legal contract with some bus operator, and they get into a legal contract with some sightseeing vendor. They fix up a rate with each and every one of them. Later, they just put together everything in one particular package and offer it to the customer at a lump sum. For example, you buy this particular Singapore package which cost you approximately 40,000 rupees. It includes your flights from Delhi to Singapore. It includes your hotel stay in a well-appointed three-star hotel it also includes so many activities it also include your visa processing and so on so that is a package for you now let's talk about the second point under the distributors tab that is the online portals now what is an online portal it can be any vendor it can be any company who is selling their product online through a website